Real Serious Body Building. What's going on, world? You are tuned into Big Zeus Body Building. I'm in the Jeep driving, and uh, no, I don't have a holder, anything for my camera. I'm holding it in my hand, so I'm only driving with one hand, but it's normally how I drive anyhow. I'm saying a lot of how. Anyhow, I'm going to the bodybuilding candy store because I'm all out of muscle dust. In case you didn't understand what I just said, I'm going to the supplement store because I need some whey protein powder. And another thing I'm going to pick up is some BCAAs because I was taking Hickamax and that is essentially a metabolite of the branch chain amino acid leucine. And the Hickamax cost $30 for a one month supply. Well, I could just take the actual branch chain amino acid supplement, get the, the full three major BCAAs, and just metabolize it in my own damn stomach and pay probably half as much as, as the Hickamax. And I think I gotta pick up some glucosamine too for joint health. So I'm hoping they got some good deals on that. Maybe I'll pick up a shaker cup if they're like a dollar. If they're more than that, forget it, because I already got enough. But the shaker cups that they have at the at this supplement store I really like. I'll do a video about my different shaker cups too, and which one is my favorite later on sometime. So that's what's up. I'm going to the supplement store. It's actually called the Supplement Warehouse. They have a website called www.supplementwarehouse.com. But they do have a warehouse store where I, around where I live, so that's where I'm going now. But seeing as how as I could just drive there in about 20 minutes, I'm not going to pay for shipping. So let's uh, continue on this journey. What, 38 degrees, something like that. Got the window open. I'm not going to crank up the tunes because YouTube will just freak out and I'll get all kinds of emails and threatening letters and guys in black suits knocking on my door because I had music playing on a YouTube video. So while I'm recording, there will be no music, just my glorious voice. Alright, we are just about there, we're going to be turning in the parking lot. And I'm gonna try and just get a few clips of the inside of the store, even though you're not supposed to film in there. So, just so you can see what it looks like. But this is the warehouse store right here. That's it, just looks like a warehouse. I uh, hope those clips kind of give you an idea of the massive size of this store and then not to mention it's just a it's a whole warehouse behind the store so basically anything that you want they have because it's a warehouse uh, I know the clips probably weren't that great but you know I'll just give you a quick look quick idea of what it's like in there and besides you know you can't really film inside these stores so I was breaking the law. But let's see what I got in my magic bag of tricks now. Uh, first thing definitely was the protein powder, whey protein. That was $45, I think, $40, $42. Uh, and then I got my glucosamine, like I said I would. That was $12. And then I got BCAAs, 
I think this was $19, something like that. And then they had this on special sale, just a cheapy uh, pre-workout. I think it was 10 bucks. Never tried this before, so I'm going to try it and see what it's like on them days that I can't really get up and get going right away. But um, all together, a total was like $88, so not bad. Uh, I think that protein is going to last me probably... Yeah, about three to four weeks. So not too bad. Not 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 bad at all. So back on the road heading home. Not really moving right now. I'm sitting at a red light, but I figured it would be a good time to turn on the camera and talk some more. Um, overall, the trip to the supplement warehouse was pleasant. I mean, they got a lot of things in stock, like I said before. And a lot of it's confusing. Like, there's so many things to look at there. You could spend an hour just walking around and tell you what, when you go for a specific thing, it's kind of hard to find. And I actually walked around the, the store for probably a good 15 to 20 minutes trying to find the BCAA uh, capsules. Couldn't find them. I was by the, it's the Optimum Nutrition brand. I was by their section, couldn't find it. I was by a, a BCAA section, couldn't find it. Finally, I had to ask somebody that worked there. Do you have this? They have it behind the counter. So I just spent like 15 minutes of my life walking around trying to look for something that I could have just asked for. So moral of the story, I guess, is when you go into these huge warehouse stores, don't be afraid to ask what you, for what you need. If there, if, if there, if there is, if even is a moral to the story, but yeah. Okay. Awkward silence. I'm going back home. I'm going to put this stuff on my supplement shelf. And I got to do an update video on the supplement shelf too. Wow. I just, like I said in uh, a few videos back, uh, what's been going on was the title. My life is just hectic trying to plan to move. So I got a lot of videos to catch up on and uh, you know a lot of different things to show you that have changed as far as supplement. I got to do a whole uh, new review of my gym few things have changed in there so I know I got things to catch up on but I'm gonna go home now I grab something to eat real quick because I did just do an arm workout stock this on my supplement shelf and enjoy the rest of my night till next time keep pumping now I just want to make sure that it's all in single layer you don't want like stuff you know, doubled up, like laying over each other. So pretty much just single layer.